So the Punchestown Champion Chase is next in. And this is another grade one. It's a two mile up. And the top one is Gigabyte for Paul Rhodes. He's also got Westminster Abbey. Cheltenham Fund for Graham Clutterbuck. The perfect monster for Joshua Sutherland. And Thunderstruck Morton for Derek Hinton. So another small field then for one of these prestige races. And away they go. And we're going to get a nice close up view again. Whoever's running these races is doing a pretty good job of figuring out that there's only five runners so we can get right up in the action. And uh, close up, and it's pretty good to see. And Thunderstruck Morsum has now gone to the lead as they take the first, and they should again all pick up a little bit of a little bit of pocket money if they all get round. Well, no guarantee of that, of course, in ESO 6, and that's what makes the on side of things so much more interesting for most people the fact that the big top trainers are not guaranteed to win because they might just fall over although well, this time they've only really got big top trainers in there well, you could maybe argue that Mr Clutterbuck and Mr Hinton are maybe in the second tier but the, the big two as they are Rhodes and Sutherland well, I think if you look at the stats of one more races between them than the rest of the league put together oh they take the third there and Thunderstruck Mawson didn't jump in all that well at all and that's not a criticism of either of those two either for winning all the races it's just the way the races are framed they can't help winning them <laughs> got the horses to put in them and you can't stop them can you really so it's just a little bit geared up for the top horses rather than the bottom ones but anyway there's only two weeks left and they're all gone. So anyway, Thunderstruck Mawson skips over fence number four. With Gigabyte next and then Cheltenham Fund and then Westminster Abbey. A perfect monster. It's just the back marker. Missing down towards the fifth then. Thunderstruck Mawson is the clear leader. Gets over that one. I'm jumping them okay. Less than a mile to go now. The halfway point. And they've only got five left to jump. Measure down towards this next one. Thunderstruck Mawson is in the lead. The one that seems to be going well in second is the perfect monster. Westminster Abbey appears to be going the best of the Rhodes pair and Cheltenham Fun. Oh, I can't remember seeing much this season. It's just about the back marker. They come down towards the fourth last. Remember that one is pretty much as you were and now all of a sudden Gigabyte has got back on a bit again and has now come through to share the lead so it's three in a line now almost Thunderstruck Morse on the perfect monster and Gigabyte and Westminster Abbey looked like he was going well a couple of furlongs ago now appears to be in a bit of trouble as they take the third from home and the perfect monster is just about the leader from Thunderstruck Morse and Gigabyte gap back to Chilton Fund and Westminster Abbey I think it's probably between the front three they come down towards the second last and the perfect monster jumped in better. Thunderstruck Mawson sticking on well. Gigabyte looks to be struggling again now. Then the perfect monster comes down towards the final fence. Looking like he's probably only got to jump it to take this one. Beginning to pull away. Comes down towards it. Gets over it nicely. The rest are getting nowhere near really. And Chilton Fund is the only one that's really trying to run on the jockey. On the lead. He's got a look over his shoulder. He knows he's got this one in the bag. It's a pretty comfortable win. And the perfect monster is going to trot up towards the line almost and take this by a good four or five lengths salutes the crowd perfect monster Chilton from Gigabyte Westminster Abbey and Thunderstruck Mawson ended up being the tail end Charlie but will still pick up a few quid for Derek Hinton the perfect monster for, Derek, for Joshua Sutherland is the winner Chilton Fun for Graham Clutterbuck second Paul Rhodes was third and fourth with Gigabyte and Westminster Abbey and Thunderstruck Mawson for Derek Hinton picks up a good two and a quarter grand in fifth